Welcome back to Easy Freezer Meals. My name's Eric, your freezer meal specialist, and today we're going to be making buttermilk fried chicken over mashed potatoes with southern gravy. And this particular dish is at the heart of soul food and comfort food Texas style. So if you want to know what it's like to eat like a Texan, this is a good start. The first thing we need to do is get that buttermilk fried chicken going. This recipe is a combination of three other recipes that we've combined to make a completely different freezer meal dish. So through this video, you're gonna see us very quickly assemble and make buttermilk fried chicken with country gravy over mashed potatoes. And in the description box below, I'm gonna link how to make buttermilk fried chicken, how to make country gravy, and how to make those creamy mashed potatoes just like you see in this video. So right now we're going to finish up the country gravy until we get it nice and thick. And as soon as we do that, we're just gonna go ahead and pour it into a bowl and set it to the side so that it can cool. Country gravy is very, very easy to make. And as soon as it gets thick enough, you can see how it coats your spoon, coats the cup, it's ready to come off the heat. Finally, we're gonna get our mashed potatoes ready. So we have the chicken, we have the country gravy cooling, and now we're gonna get our mashed potatoes going. And all I'm doing is I'm putting some corn, some butter, a little cream, a little milk. I'm gonna add my seasonings and my eggs to this particular mixture. And all of this is gonna get tossed with the mashed potatoes and it's gonna deliver a really creamy, velvety, smooth mashed potato experience. I'm gonna take roughly about 50 to 75 pounds of mashed potatoes. I'm gonna peel them and boil them. And as soon as I do that, I'm gonna put them through a ricer. And then we're gonna go ahead and whip in that delicious butter, egg, cream, corn mixture that we just put together. And now the only difference between this particular mashed potato recipe that we're making and the video that I'm gonna link you to is the addition of corn. So if you follow that other recipe, just add some corn and now you got it going on. And look at this, now we're done. We've got our creamy, delicious, amazing mashed potatoes and we're gonna go ahead and plate it up. Now, if you're gonna be having this for dinner, plate up as much as you guys are gonna eat and go back for seconds because you know this is gonna be good. This is how we do it with the leftovers. And so we take all of the extra potatoes, we line our tins and we generally make this portion for two. We weigh out our chicken and we're gonna take that chicken and put it right on the top of each one of them. It couldn't be simpler. And then guess what? We're gonna coat the whole thing with country gravy. There it is. Before you freeze it, make sure that that country gravy is completely cooled down. That way you don't run any risk of any kind of bacteria growing. And all we're gonna do is put a little top on it and pop it in the freezer. And from this state, these are good in these containers for roughly about six months, give or take. And that's how you make buttermilk fried chicken. But I know you are going to want to see what the end result product looks like. And so I want you to imagine a spud, all right, a baked potato loaded with your favorite toppings. Now, in this case, it's going to be chicken and gravy. But potatoes are one of those vegetables that freeze extremely well. Twice baked potatoes, potatoes au gratin, mashed potatoes. So just to give you some ideas, maybe in another video, we'll do some different ways to use potato recipes in your easy freezer meal. So all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take that out, pop it in the oven, and I'm gonna take it out of the oven and show you what it looks like now. Because of the nature of this dish, this is supposed to be eaten as more of an overall combination of ingredients. So instead of diving right into that as it is, we're gonna take it out of the tin and we're gonna go ahead and plate it up. And we wanna make sure that we get all that gravy in there, all that corn. We're gonna sprinkle some delicious cheddar cheese right on top, put a little bit of parsley, and there you have it. Texas style buttermilk fried chicken with country gravy and creamy mashed potatoes. I wish you could smell this. This smells absolutely amazing and it tastes just as good. I hope you get a chance to make this dish, and if you do, leave me a comment in the comment section below, and let me know what you thought. If you got any questions, leave them in the comment section below. I read every comment and answer every question, and if you're new to this channel, consider subscribing. Each week, we post new recipes on how to make really cool, fun, easy freezer meals. Give me a thumbs up if you liked it. Don't forget to share. We'll see you in the next video.